Look around and you see so many people break under the downward pressure of whatever this is. And you look with disdain and sadness as you see people you know become quizlings. You see them going along with a new, new thing, which is clearly a poisonous thing. The United States now resembles a one-party state, but this is not permanent. Tucker's bold expression of views in a recent video without fear of backlash is noteworthy since his departure from Fox News. The connection between him and Elon Musk is intriguing. As allies, they may introduce groundbreaking news like a new company or even Twitter 2.0. Musk's plans, which could shape our lives, remain a mystery. This sudden turn of events sparks both concern and anticipation. Let's explore Musk's plans for a creation that will revolutionize our everyday lives forever. However, before we begin our video, we would greatly appreciate it if you would subscribe to our YouTube channel and also press the bell icon. Now let's get started. It all began when Tucker was fired from Fox News Channel. Though the exact reason remains unknown, the leaked video you just saw sheds light on the situation. Can you imagine speaking to your boss that way? Interestingly, Musk plans to team up with Tucker, who has become known for opposing progressive ideology and criticizing immigration. Since departed from Fox News, Tucker has been subjected to various labels by different channels. His persona became the talk of the town and a popular topic of discussion among news channels. People still wonder why he was fired from the show, while other news anchors are amazed at how quickly he moved on. Within days, the former news reporter announced his partnership with the world's wealthiest man, leaving everyone in awe. Losing his job was not the only consequence for Tucker when he was fired from the news channel. He also lost his reputation, fan base, and even access to his email accounts. That's quite a lot to endure. Tucker has been hosting the show since 2013, and over the years he has worked hard to make it one of the most famous talk shows. Not only was he beloved as a host, but he also had a significant influence and people admired the image he had cultivated. The talk show soared to the top throughout his tenure, attracting around 3 million daily viewers. In 2020, Tucker's show became the most watched program with approximately 5.3 million viewers. Thanks to his dedicated fan base and influential personality, the news program consistently maintained over 4 million viewers for a year. His dynamic persona made him a favored subject for news channels to discuss. While some labeled him a right-wing extremist, others recognized him as a critic of immigration. Tucker has always been unafraid to voice his opinions on global affairs, expressing them boldly. When the Russian war in Ukraine began, it seemed like he took a pro-Russian stance. Did this mean he supported Russia's invasion of Ukraine? Tucker criticized the U.S. military for depleting its resources and manpower while sending advanced weapons to Ukraine. He believed the country's interests were not prioritized, placing the people last on the list. Tucker's delivery of his views can be harsh, using insults and degradation to assert his point rather than adopting a persuasive tone. During the invasion, he refrained from expressing hatred towards Putin, prompting audiences to question why they harbored such animosity towards him. Tucker argued that Putin should not be seen as an enemy, urging people to acknowledge the often overlooked issues in the world. He emphasized that the true enemies are the white American racists, self-serving business elites, and the complexities surrounding race in schools. Tucker also voiced his opinion to the U.S. lockdowns. In essence, Tucker strongly voices his opinions, identifying those he considers to be the enemies of the world. This extends beyond political figures like Putin. While he publicly supported Donald Trump on news channels, privately he regards Trump as nothing more than an idiot. When in a position of power, one can speak without fear of consequence. Tucker expressed himself without reservation at the height of his news anchoring career. His extreme tendencies overshadowed his diplomatic side, leading to frequent clashes and heated debates. Eventually, the unexpected news broke that Tucker had been fired from his TV show. The announcement of Tucker's firing came as a shock to the world. The organizers provided no legal notice or official statement, leaving the reason for his dismissal undisclosed. It was revealed that the decision was made to settle a defamation lawsuit primarily targeting Carlson. Despite his positive image, the news channel had to pay a substantial settlement of $1.6 million. The Dominion voting system filed the lawsuit, accusing Fox of manipulating machines against Trump. 
If the case had solely focused on Tucker's criticism of Trump, the channel might have tolerated it. However, the court case escalated beyond control. Amidst the case discussions, both sides exchanged embarrassing messages and voice notes, putting Tucker's public image at risk and causing concern for the organization. This led to several defamation lawsuits against Tucker, including one from Abby Grossberg, a former senior booking producer. Despite these legal battles, the news channels never disclosed the actual reason behind his firing. Internal sources hinted at inappropriate text messages revealed and cited Tucker's bossy and dominant demeanor as contributing factors. In this situation, Tucker turned to Elon Musk for collaboration after being let go from his prominent position. Tucker admired Musk's commitment to free speech, unlike other CEOs from companies like Google, Apple, and Facebook. Musk's philanthropic endeavors are also highly regarded. Following Elon Musk's appearance as a final guest on Tucker's talk show, their friendship soared to new heights. This camaraderie led Tucker to align with many of Musk's statements, including their mutual agreement on the topic of the rising population. The impact of this alignment was so significant that the two even struck a substantial deal together. Sources indicate that Musk offered Tucker a prominent role at Twitter, proposing him as a CEO of the social media platform. Musk confirmed this surprising development in a tweet, expressing his enthusiasm for Tucker's new position and eagerly anticipating the transformative impact he would have on the platform. The choice of Tucker Carlson as the recipient of this offer leaves us intrigued. In a world where AI is increasingly prevalent, with many individuals still unfamiliar with or casually engaging with it on their phones, the implications raise questions about the overall effects. The subject of AI has been a long-standing fascination for both Tucker and Musk, with Tucker expressing his thoughts on its potential impact on the future. The conversation between Tucker and Musk in the video appears captivating as they seem to share a similar outlook. Tucker's alignment with Musk's viewpoints impressed the visionary entrepreneur. The announcement shocked many people and anchors as they never expected Elon Musk to make such abrupt and impulsive decisions. While Tucker enjoys a strong fan base as an anchor, he lacks experience in the technology field. Concerns arise regarding Tucker's tendency to express controversial views, potentially risking his CEO image. However, Elon Musk firmly believes he made the right choice. He praises Tucker's exceptional ability to connect with people, emphasizing his positive impression on the audience. Given Twitter's recent criticism and the backlash Musk faced after firing numerous employees, he believes Tucker's appointment is what the platform needs. With the acquisition, Twitter requires a reputation boost. Seizing the opportunity after Tucker's dismissal, Musk offered him an unexpected position. Tucker is thrilled about this new opportunity, as evident from his recent tweet expressing enthusiasm for his role as Twitter's new CEO and his eagerness to contribute his unique perspective. Elon Musk has repeatedly expressed concerns about AI, predicting a future where machines replace humans. He believes we must elevate ourselves above these machines before that time arrives. Tucker Carlson appears to share these beliefs, which may explain why Musk selected him as CEO. They share a similar worldview. While people still wonder what fresh perspective Tucker brings to the table, it's important to acknowledge that Twitter's position in the industry has changed over the years. The company is currently struggling and needs to implement new strategies to regain its position among the top platforms. Some may consider hiring an inexperienced individual as a hasty decision. However, Elon Musk has always been known for his unconventional thinking, evident in his ventures like SpaceX and Tesla. Whenever Musk makes significant decisions, he faces criticism and harsh comments. Yet, time and again, Musk proves his detractors wrong. While some may doubt the choice he made, it's possible that he has a well-thought-out plan in collaboration with Tucker. This decision might be what Twitter needs to reclaim its prominence in the industry. And that's it for today. We hope you found our video interesting. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and share it with others. Also, if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to our channel. Don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of our new uploads. And in the end, thanks for watching and see you next time.